Hey. Hey. Morning, Dad. Hey. Morning, Pa. Anybody make coffee? We're on pot number two. We were up all night long. You're kidding. Uh-uh. Nellie oh couldn't sleep. Again. I couldn't sleep, so I made Shell stay up with me. Yeah. Well, <laughs> so I'm glad you didn't wake coffee. me up. I slept pretty good. <laughs> Here's some pictures. Do you want to look through them? Yeah. Look at how young Mom and Dad look. <laughs> they look like babies. I know. That one I like. That was funny. I love these photo shoot ones. That was right before yeah, she got Yeah, those are beautiful. All right, what's going on? We're looking through these pictures. <laughs> you guys have some good ones in here. Yeah. Lola looks just like Mom. Yeah, she does. I was very hard going through all of our old pictures and of my wife and the memories that we had as a family. And it's something that takes a very long time to get through. And I'm not sure how, how long that time is, but I'm not there yet. And I don't think they are either. This is um, when she bought those books. A few months before my mom passed away, she got my daughters a book that explains death to kids. I think I should bring it back for the girls and start reading it to them. She wrote a very, very special note to them, letting them know that she would always be their angel. Sammy and Lola, I arrived here fine. I can't read it. I know. <laughs> I will be in your life morning, noon, and night. When you think of me, I will be there to protect you from our always loved you. I can't believe she thought to do that. It's so thoughtful that she was thinking about them more than herself. Seeing my mom's words it was so brave of her to write that, knowing she didn't have much time. I'm tired looking at these pictures of her. And as sad and as hard as this is, it made me realize I have to be brave right now, and I have to get through this, and I have to move forward. I think it'll be good to say goodbye to the house. We're ready. I'm ready to move on. Yep. <laughs> I think I'm finally ready to let go, grieve my mom, go home, and see my girls.